Thanks for coming with me to the doctor, Morphle, even though it might be a little boring. Morphle like doctor. That's good to hear. Now, if you could take a seat right here. Is your sight better or worse? Worse. And now? Better. And now? It's the same. All done. Morpho want to test you. All right, then. How well can you see, Morpho? No good. And now? Uh... How about now? Yeah, yeah. Morpho, she good. As I expected. I'll print out the results for you. Be sure not to mix them up, Morpho. Ooh. Bye-bye. Hey, wait up, Morpho. See you next time, Doctor. Bye now. Now, let me see that test result of mine, Morpho. Oh, wow. It says here, I don't need glasses anymore. Now let me see your test, Morpho. Oh, dear. It looks like you need my glasses. Let's get them adjusted so they will fit you. Are you happy with your glasses, Morpho? Yeah, Morpho happy, but Morpho see bad. Me too, but I'm sure the doctor knows best. I think our eyes just need a little time to adjust. In the meantime, why don't we go play at the beach? Hmm, people are not very friendly today. Wow, it's a great day at the beach. These are the best waves I've ever seen. But all that surfing made me hungry. Let's get some ice cream. Refreshing. Mmm. Let me see if it's time to pick up Mila from school. I think we still have time to feed the magic pets back at the store, Morphle. I think it's time we call your dad. I can't believe they forgot about me. I need to feed Brother Time. Could you hand me that magic pet food, Morphle? What are you doing? Are you blind? Far from it. We just had our eyes checked, Police Officer Freeze. I'm not Police Officer Freeze. I'm Zookeeper Kenneth. You can it! Anyway, Morphle needs glasses now, and I don't. Hey! See? You need glasses, and Morphle doesn't. Hey! This isn't the magic pet shop. Oh, no. We must have mixed up the test results. And look at the time. We need to pick up Mila from school, Morphle. Oh, Mila! Those guys... I'm glad they have Mila who can keep an eye on them. Oh no, I lost my glasses. Don't worry, Daddy. Just remember where you had them last. Hmm, yeah, good idea. Maybe I lost them when we went to the North Pole to find the Jolly Fat. <laughs> yeah. Morphle loved the jelly fin because he makes ice cream! Ah, yes. Now I remember. I slipped on a banana split and lost my glasses. But the jelly fin caught them, remember? Oh, yeah. That's right. Yeah. 
So where did he go next? Maybe I lost them while we were bringing Papa Jungle to its new human companion in the desert this morning. Oh yeah! Now I remember! That jungle monkey stole my glasses. We have to go back to the desert and find it. No, Daddy. Morpho morphed into a monkey, too. And gave it back. Oh, yeah, I remember. Hmm. So you didn't lose your glasses in the desert. Where else could you have lost them? Next, we had to catch the escaped magic pet, Chuckles. His magic power is that he makes people laugh uncontrollably. Chuckles made me laugh so hard, my glasses fell off. Yep, but I caught them and gave them back. Ah, yeah, you're right. Do you remember what you did after that, Daddy? After that, I came home and sat down. <laughs> you were sitting on them the whole time, Daddy. <laughs> You're right. Yes. Uh, much better. Bandits were just here. They stole all my clothes. Uh -uh. Don't worry, Daddy. We have more than enough clothes in our dress-up box. Now, let's see. How should we dress up Daddy? <laughs> you look beautiful, Daddy. We're no longer the chain of office bandits. Now we're the fashion bandits. We will steal all of the city's clothes. Beware. Costume. You're right. We should give the police officer a costume, too. Here, Mr. Police Officer. Excellent. Now after the fashion bandits. We must stop them from stealing all the clothes. After them, Morpho!
You can't stop us. Soon, no one will have any clothes left. Oh, no! The helicopter is falling! Morpho, use your strong arms to catch it. Where are they? I'll catch them this time. Here you go, Mr. Mayor. We have a costume for you, too. Thank you, Mila. Now you have to stop those bandits. The city needs you. There's one. I'll catch him. It's up to us, Morphle. Use your wings. are no match for the fashion bandits. And now, we have your little red friend. <laughs> Silly bandits. Morphle, use your strong arms. Morphle, use your wings. Well done, Mila and Morpho. You caught the bandits, and now everyone can get back their clothes. The mayor should give you a medal. Now, where is that mayor? Today is Halloween, Morpho. We need to find you the right scary look. What is going on? Why is everybody wearing weird outfits? I love your costumes. You two look exactly like real pirates. You should compete in the Halloween costume contest. Come on, Pirate Phil! And the winners are... The guys in these incredible pirate costumes. Allow me to give you this award. What? Give? You are not giving us this award. We are stealing this award. <laughs> oh no, they're real pirates. Amazing! Come, Morpho! Let's go trick-or-treating! We need to get back at them by stealing all of their candy. But how? That morphal creature isn't afraid of anything.
scare of ghosts. <laughs> the look on your face is priceless. Halloween is my favorite holiday because I love to scare children. <laughs> no real ghost? No, Morphle, don't worry. Ghosts don't exist. So, the only thing Morphle is scared of are ghosts, eh? <laughs> Come on, Phil. Let's go. Look, Morphle. Thanks to you, we've collected lots of candy. Boo. I'm a scary ghost. Your red blob can't protect you now. All your candy belongs to us. <laughs> Morphle, it's me. Don't be scared. We need your help, Morphle. The pirates took everyone's candy. Burr, burr, ghost is scary. Boo. Morphle, ghosts aren't real. Look. Ghosts no real? Nope. You don't have to be afraid, Morphle. Hi. Ghosts no real. Oh, no. He took all the candy we stole. Pirate Phil, Morphle didn't take your candy? I didn't steal this candy, Pirate Maurice. I got it because some parents liked my pirate costume. It's called trick or treating. What? Hm. Give me some candy too, Pirate Phil. No, Pirate Maurice. I trick or treated for this myself. Get your own candy. Oh, come on, Pirate Phil. Just a wee bit of candy. Just one piece. I don't piece care. I don't want to hear it. Go get your own candy. It's called trick or treating. There are lots of different basic shapes. For instance, there are squares, circles, triangles, rectangles, ovals, stars, and heart shapes. With my latest invention, I can turn those shapes into real objects. If you combine different shapes, you can create lots of new shapes. Now, let's try making a motorbike. Morphle, morph into a crane so we can put the shapes together. Tumbling test tubes. I'll go after it. Worry not. 
Uh-oh. I hope Professor Rashid stops the tire soon. Morphle, what are you doing? Morphle make a uh, no real animal. A fantasy animal? That's a great idea. A strange animal took one of the tires of my truck. Ah! Hmm. Morphle, do you remember what shape Professor Rashid turned into a tire? Shaka? Yeah! Morphle, put a circle where the tire needs to be. Wow! Thank you, Mila and Morphle. Hi, Mila and Morphle. I was just waiting here for uh, someone with a big heart-shaped box of chocolates. And all of a sudden, it has disappeared. Good idea, Morphle. Thank you so much. Oh, here she comes. Some strange creature came by and stole our surfboards. And now, we can't surf anymore. Morphle, make a surfboard? Yeah! Now, what shape could turn into a surfboard? Shapey, 
You can't just take things from other people. Ah, look! Wow! It looks just like you, Shapey. That's why you took all the different shapes. You wanted to build yourself a friend. These objects do have the same shapes as you, Shapey. But the zapper can only zap to like Professor Rashid's special shapes. But we can build a friend for you using Professor Rashid's shapes. The magic letters are gone. I had every letter of the alphabet in my truck. Is that one of them, Daddy? Ah, uh, yes. It's the T for tree. Look over there, in that yellow car. The C for car, and the Y for yellow. Here, everything you catch with this magic pet transporter hoop will end up in the magic pet store. Have you catch all of the letters for me, Mila? Of course, Daddy. Let's start with the A, Morphle. A, A, uh, airplane. That's right. Let's find an airplane. Let's keep on 
going, Morphle? The D for desert. The V for volcano. The N for the North Pole. Places where the magic letters could be? M, M, M is moon. You're right. Let's go to the moon. It's the S for space. Say, are you looking for this little guy? The U for UFO. I was on my way to Professor Rashid, but I got lost. Don't worry, we'll get you there. No, oh, tumbling test tubes. Look. It's the L for laboratory. Hmm. Maybe that also explains why there is a Q in my quantum physics experiment. Only a few more, Morphle. And I think I know just where to find them. F is for fire truck. P is for policeman. Huh? R is for race track. Do you know where we can find the Z Morphle? Uh, so that's right. Hi, Mila and Morphle. What brings you to the zoo? We're looking for all the magic letter pets. And we only need the Z for zoo. Well, it sounds like your friends are waiting for you. <laughs> oh, Mila and Morphle. 